Hello, in this video I have a Hey Little Magpie haul to share with you and just to warn you, it's going to be a big one. So this video could very well, possibly, very likely be quite a long one. So yeah, um, for those who don't know, I'm sure many of you do, but last week on the 4th, Hey Little Magpie started their massive half price sale. Um, I was actually very lucky to get my order because so many people tried to access the website on Tuesday that the whole thing just crashed. It just went blech. So I actually, my cat woke me up the next morning at about 5am. I was like, well, as I'm awake, I'll go have a look. And I managed to order. I hope probably because not that many people were awake at that time and the website hadn't been working properly for very long by that point. So yes, there are a couple of things I wanted that were out of stock. Only one thing I was disappointed I didn't get, a uh, Paige Evans, um, six by six paper pad and also because of all the craziness some of the things that I'd ordered were actually out of stock just the website hadn't caught up but I've been refunded for those so it's fine and it was only two items so it's fine so anyway enough chitter chatter um let's get into this box so a good I'd say 60 to 70 percent of what was on sale was papers so to explain why this video might be quite long is because yeah, we got like nearly an inch, well maybe not quite, but a lot of papers to get through. But I will show you the other items first and then go through this wedge, absolute wedge of papers. Okay, so the first thing I picked up is actually something that wasn't on sale, it was something that was in my basket already, which is the uh, cardstock sticker sheet from the My Mind's Eye in Bloom collection. I love this collection. I haven't finished using it yet, so I just got another sticker sheet because two pounds, really not that bad. So that's one thing. There's also a couple, three, maybe four papers that I got that weren't sale items either. So, but yes, I'll point those out when the when the time comes. But they were in my basket anyway, and I wanted them. So there we go. So there's the first thing, but again, not sale. And then all the other non-paper items are actually all out for stickers and thickers. So it's actually a pretty boring haul in that it's only papers and thickers, but never mind. So let's have a little look at these, shall we? So first thing is the Heidi Swap Alpha stickers. These are Project Life ones, I believe. And these were uh, £2.50. Obviously reduced down from five. You're getting the point, everything was half price. So yes, in here, they're sort of plasticky ones, if that makes sense. So we've got the lime greeny ones, moving into a sort of dark teal, and then going into a pink just really cute ones and i am lacking in small alpha stickers at least small nice ones i've got plenty of just like cheap ones and stuff but really nice ones to do small titles or journaling or whatever i'm lacking in so i picked these up okay so these are the fancy pants designs goodfellows gray puffy alpha stickers i just love the font on these I think it's just really funky and fun and I love all these little asterisks and stuff asterisks it's a hard word to say that but yes there's those really like those then again fancy pants designs good fellows um these are just called patterned puffy alpha stickers I don't know how well it's showing up but there is obviously they're a sort of sky blue color but there's the faintest faintest little dot grid pattern on them I don't want to get them all out of packaging for every single one because we'll be here for hours as it is but uh yes a little a very 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 slight little pattern on there very subtle very pretty and then the fancy pants million june patterned alpha stickers love 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 the florals on these so we've got a very very light sky blue background with a beautiful colorful floral on so super pretty then two from Coco Vanilla. We've got Free Spirit and Make-A-Wish. There are the Free Spirit ones, a sort of slightly beige-ish grey with a polka dot. And the Make-A-Wish are just a beautiful mix of a watercolour floral and a, a sort of a mint stripe and a pink polka dot. Very, very pretty. Then the Pink Fresh Black Foam thickers. Obviously they weren't $4.99, they were half price and these, I've just been after these ones for a while because I really like the font and I like the way 
that these E's are done because that's how I do my E's. Um, so yeah, love, love, love those. Then the, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Pink, paisley, fancy free, page Evans, blah, 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 blah. you know, you know the score. Um, thickers and yeah, just, just gloriously gorgeous. This is like a three pack. So you've got the first half of the alphabet on this one, then the second half of the alphabet and then numbers on the back there. So yes, we've got a, just an absolute mix of colours and stuff here so yay and then lastly for alphas and something that's not a 12 by 12 paper <laughs> um are these l studio mint letter and number stickers these weren't in the sale these were already living in my basket they had been for some time but i love mint and as i was saying before about needing some smaller smaller alphas so yes really just really wanted them yeah I lied, I found more thickers. What is that? That's a bit of my plant that's fallen off a dead bit. Um, yes, I found more thickers. These were sale items, these ones. These are Amy Tangerine Better Together here and the chipboard thickers. Love these, love a good old school typewriter typeface, and it's navy blue, so I think this will go a lot. Go a lot. Good words. Go well with some of the nautical stuff I've got going on at the moment. So yes. Very happy with those. All right, paper time. Are you ready for this? Yeah, okay, gonna take a while. Let's go. Go get a tea or a coffee or a wine or a very large glass of whiskey. I don't know, but let's, we're going, let's go. Okay, I'm just gonna start very quickly with the non-sale papers because there's only four of them. Um, both my mind's eye, firstly stuff from the Meow collection because I just wanted these papers because these are ones where I I wanted another one of this one just because I love it and I wanted this one so I wanted to use both sides so yeah um so this one is called here kitty kitty Got that one and this one is catitude with little balls of wool and the cats on the other side which I might fussy cut I haven't decided yet though do it doing the whiskers will be virtually impossible but anyway then from in bloom I got another one of Le Jardin because um yeah I just love it so much it's so pretty and I just couldn't decide of the one I had which side to use because we've got the beautiful black and gold foil polka dots on this side and then this on the other I love black and white stripes I love these florals so had to get another one of that and this one is called beautiful and yeah just so pretty oh, that side looks like that so there you go there are the full price items and let's get on to this epic pile of sale items All right we start with chamel starshine i got the um journal card sort of cut apart sheet because i have the six by six paper pad and a sticker pad from this so i thought although i don't have the whole collection i'll get some bits and bobs from it so got this the other side looks like that but obviously i will use the card side on the branding strip on this how pretty is that? So pretty. And then the other one, which is called Pioneer, has this lovely map of the world going on. I thought this would um, maybe slightly go with the Prima um, Saint Tropez collection, maybe just as a, a background piece, I think. If it doesn't, I'll use it for something else. I just thought it was really pretty. Other side like looks like that. Don't like it. Makes my eyes go funny. But again, really nice branding trip going on there. Then I got two of these My Mind's Eye by the Sea papers. There was a 1212 sticker sheet, I think it was, but that was out of stock. That's one of the things I was sad face about. But I just I just love this. Love, love, love might fussy cut up one of them the other side has this uh stripe with the slight wood grain effect on the green and it's called all aboard so yeah two of those i'm trying to do these in collections by the way if you're wondering why i'm just showing you one or two at a time this is million june so fancy pants designs million june and this is why it's called little sis i just loved this 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 light minty turquoise with the tiny 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 little heart print just so much yes the other side looks like that 
won't be using that because it's all about this side and this one is a textured piece as well so okay next is a bunch of simple stories papers these are all from posh love posh don't have enough from posh and i'm desperately trying to find another ephemera pack from the posh collection can't find anyone anywhere at the moment at least one that's not got ridiculous international posting or whatever but that's by the by papers so first is live simply which just simple looks like that and that's the other side definitely prefer that side um then the journaling card elements so these are the three by fours and it's obviously as you can see got gold foiling on and it's so so super pretty and i love it especially that one is just stunning and that one oh yeah i'm just making noises and the other side looks like this this are uh, this this are uh, this are, this is the 4x4 and 4x6 journaling elements cards and you can just see same kind of thing on there. This one is not foiled though, but it is very, very, very pretty. Then I got two of the 2x12, 4x12 and 6x12 elements. So this side, as you can see, you've got this big old thing going on down here live simply dream big be grateful and love lots the little doggy and the lovely floral print and the other side looks like this i love this although it kind of reminds me of the front of a school exercise book just a really pretty one with the florals and the last one from posh is the laugh lots one i just oh love 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 those little foil geometric hearts, they are beautiful and the other side looks like that. So yes, there's the Simple Stories stuff. Okay, I lied, there was one more full price item. This is uh, Pink Paisley Page Evans. Oh, what's the name of the collection? Why you no say? Oh my heart paper and this is paper 15 i don't know why they don't do titles it upsets me greatly but anyway um yes i have the six by six for this but i just i want to fussy cut these books i just i just oh gonna sit down for an evening and do so much fussy cutting and it's gonna be the best evening ever i'm really excited about it but this is the other side like that which i also really like down here i should have got two oh annoying then this is the Amy Tangerine Better Together Soap and Water Paper. This was one of the ones I actually ordered two of these, but they could only, they only have one left in stock. So I was refunded for the other one, which makes me sad because the reason I got two is because I really like both sides of this. So I don't know what I'm do, going to do about that problem. I'll just have to find another one from somewhere. I don't know. But anyway, yes, there we go. And then they had some of the 12 by 12 value packs on half price they had i think it was maggie holmes gather which i didn't actually want then this one the amy tan oh happy life and the other one which i'll show you and these are 20 sheets and they were this one i think was seven pound and the other one was six pound which is just so such a good price and i was so freaking happy that these were still in stock by the time i did my order because yeah so i will let's go through these as quickly as possible so first from the amy tan oh happy life is the everyday happy as you see this is a sort of a cut apart one long strips bigger cards and stuff like that the other side is actually really really pretty in and of itself but i would use the the cut apart next is sweet things which looks like this on that side and this very fun paper on that side next is little moments with these gorgeous arrows on that side and a yellow stripe on the other then we have rise and shine beautiful colors on this one and the other side that's really pretty actually the color isn't usually my thing but it is pretty next one is sure thing and i love this one because those pale green leaves are just yes and the other side is also oh i'm loving both of those sides i hate it when i love both sides then this one which isn't really my thing but i've decided i like it because it's called midnight snack and that made me laugh so 
I like it for, for its title. <laughs> um, you could colour that in if you were so inclined, but I do really like the other side actually, so I will probably use that one, but still, midnight snack, lol. Then next is crazy fun, loving all those dots, so, so pretty. The other side is another black and white, makes my eyes go a little funny actually, I'm not gonna lie, so let's, let's put it on down on that side. Then out and about, I'm not sure how I would use this because it feels a little obvious as to how it's wanted to be used as a scrapbook page. You know, you put your photo there and would put some other other stuff around and I'd, I don't I don't know. But anyway, the other side has these cameras on, which I might just pass you out, I don't know, or would make great backing paper. I, ju I just don't know. We'll, we'll see how we go. This one is beautiful this is oh lovely and i am just loving 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 those hearts and the other side has this kind of weird but fine um geometric blue pattern actually kind of reminds me of this year's kiki k inspiration range a bit so maybe i could use it with that and the branding strip has these hearts which i am loving this one is called sweetie and i love it it's so cute and glorious and pretty and yeah love it the other side is like that but let's leave it on that side because it's miles better then a cut apart called all smiles in that sort of signature amy town font love 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 it very very good little titles and stuff there oh other side sorry my bad looks like that oh i do actually really like that hmm, yes then we have another cut apart called big deal this is of that sort of style that isn't really doing it for me personally. Like I like some of the elements, but it's, it's not really my thing. Like it ain't completely, completely doing it for me. This one, however, is called Good Morning and it is very much doing it for me. Hello. So yes, very, very pretty florals on that. Love, love those. And the other side, a big old fat yellow stripe. Also really nice. This one, I didn't even need to look at the branding strip to know it was called Happy, because kind of obvious. But, um, it is pretty, I like it a lot. And the other side is really doing it for me with those scattered dots on a minty turquoise background. So, yup, yup, yup. This one is called Night Owl. Again, it's this style that's not really, it just meh. It's nice, it's pretty, but it makes me say, Nah, I don't know. You might like it and that's cool, but yeah. The other side looks like this and I can't decide if I like it or not because it is pretty and I love the colours, but my eyes are going a little bit cross-eyed, so yeah. This one is called 11am. Absolutely loving, loving this. Just so much yes with those little clouds and raindrops and stuff. Yes, yes, yes. And oh my, okay, that's almost painful to look at like i like it but the the mix of those stripes like if i move it i might make you feel sick are you feeling sick yet do you feel sick i don't know let's turn it around shall we then another cut apart this one is called yes please and yep loving it very beautiful very pretty always an adventure a little camper van loving that and then that side is nah let's just put that away too many papers i'm gonna have to go another layer down so this one is no worries love the sunglasses absolutely just gorgeous love them that side again another stripe really like that so let's put you there shall we there you go this one is called a great day beautiful beautiful feathers might fussy cut them don't know we'll, we'll see how it goes and then this side just with the crosses and stuff really really pretty this one is called Cruising Along. I do already have this one and I'm perfectly happy to have another one. And the other side has this interesting mix of patterns on the back. So we'll, we'll stick with this long stripped one. Yes, yes. This one is called Weekend. It's another one that kind of makes me eh. It, it just kind of reminds me of an adult colouring book. Do you know what I mean? I, like, I have one of those adult colouring books, which I admit I don't actually use at all. Um, and it just it just looks like the stuff that's in there. So, yeah. But, a nice... Mm, not sure what colour we're going to call that, but it's a good colour and I will use that side. 
my goodness this is going to be the longest video ever what's next we've got enjoy the ride with all the camper vans i'm going to speed this up a bit by the way because we've just been here for too long and then that on the back then we have hello sunshine with these giraffes on pretty fun could make a card actually i will probably probably actually too many too many words um make a card for like a nephew or my little brother or something with this i think that would that blah, 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 that is what i would do with that however if you wanted to do something that was slightly art deco-y that would be a good side for that and the last paper in this collection anyway is the around town so we've got all these different shapes and stuff overlapping each other and then a red polka dot or red and orange polka dot on the back so there we go Whew, there is the oh happy life one is that 20 sheets it feels like more i'm gonna count one, two, three. it was 24 sheets that might be why it was slightly more money than the other one but let's time to show you the other one now Okay, so the other value pack I got, this one was £6 for 20 sheets, is the Dear Lizzie Saturday. I realise this has been out forever, but I don't care because I like it. Um, slight story behind this is I got a couple of sheets from this from the from Planicon, from the Mrs Brimble stall. And there was a couple of papers which I just loved both sides of so much. I actually had those individual papers in my Hey Little Magpie basket, ready to check out whenever I was going to do an order. Um, and then this came on the sale and I was like you know what let's go for it and buy the whole lot so I did so yes let's go through these so this one is called 7th Avenue and how we have all these townhouses and stuff absolutely loving that and the other side has these really really pretty like flower doodles and stuff so that is lovely this one is skyline loving that navy blue the other side has these diagonal stripes on this one is called Lincoln Tunnel and you've got all these little yellow cabs, absolutely so so cute. The other side has this sort of slightly faded um, brush stripe thingy, whatever the word is for that. This one is The Empire, we've got all these really really pretty arrows on a very pale pink background and then a black polka dot with, I love this little branding strip down here as well that's really nice this one makes me very very happy it's called stoop and it's got lots of cute little birdies on yay i love little birdies on a, especially when they're on a very pale blue background yay and the other side has these very interesting little shapes yes like that oh i do really like that damn i want to this is City Lights. Not sure what I think about that. I don't know. Most It's mostly screaming photo backing paper to me, personally. But I do actually really like this other side with the ampersands. That is lush. But yeah, okay. This is Madison Avenue. Absolutely love those really simple yellow flowers. And then the other side is a bit of a make your eyes go funny one. Yeah, I don't like that. Let's look at the flowers instead. Pretty flowers. Then we have Metro with these faded sort of watercolour little crosses or classes and the other side has this really fun geometric pattern on the back. I like it on both sides of that one. This one is Bright Lights. Love all these little cameras. Probably will fussy cut them out. Let's, I don't know yet. And the other side has this sort of slightly wonky grid one and a, another really pretty branding strip going on down there as well oh i'm getting tired i don't know about you guys who should have done a two-part video um this one is called uptown again such pretty florals that one is flipping stunning as is the other side why do they always do this to me when i absolutely love one side then i turn it over and i'm going oh for goodness sake i love both sides ah annoying this cut apart is called Broadway. I mean, these are often off. off blah, 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 blah. These are clearly very journaling centered journaling cards because there's lots of space for writing. I really like this one with the townhouses and the little birdies. And the other side, ah! no, I love that side. It's it's awesome. And the little birdies, oh, yes, 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 yes. This one is called Staten Island, again making it obvious that it's to do with um, New York. And then, so yes, I've got these little hanging tag type things with various little phrases 
on and the other side has I don't know what to call that how to say I don't know what would you call that what would you call that I don't know what one would call that but again another branding strip that's really pretty this one is called bagels lol now I really fancy a bagel damn it but yes as you can see just really really pretty slightly faded sort of watercolor effect circles that's overlap each other and stuff and the other side has this pattern on which is also really really nice it's a little bit ouch but i like the colors so yeah this one is called queens and it's covered in numbers as you can see and the other side has a geometric yellow then this is one of the ones that I got that I mentioned at Planicon and liked both sides so much I wanted but two of them. So this one is Washington Square. This one has this really beautiful black polka dot with the florals on and the other side has this really, really, really nice faded ombre, all sorts of things going on there. Pale pink stripe. Yes. Words. And this is the other one that I wanted two sides of I can't remember now if there was two or three but whatever um this one is downtown I just love this splattered dots effect going on there with the navy and the pink just so so flipping pretty and then the other side has got this navy stripe which is also just so so oh it's lovely this one is called street food and as you see it's just a load of apples and pears in various watercolors and yep very pretty the other side has these squares which i also really like all right three papers left people we're almost at the end we've got brooklyn those colors are just doing it for me oh, i love them so much and the other side has these numbers and another gorgeous branding strip as well what is with, with these branding strips they're all so pretty then this one is called pizza pie and as you see it's a cut apart with various shapes and stuff really really like those that bike one is very pretty the other side has this um what is it called over the pond i can't think we call it the tube but i can't remember what you guys call it like the map of that but i won't use that <laughs> So after all that, I'm just saying, I'm not going to use it. And then the last paper, we have reached the end. There we go. This one is Manhattan and we have all these different arrows and stuff. I do like this one a lot. I love the colours. And the other side has a pattern. I don't know how to, what to, what to, it loves stripes, but also geometric. I don't know, but I don't really like it. So we'll talk about that side. Okay. There we go. I am exhausted and I'm going to assume you are too. So everyone take 50 life points for making it through this video. The Hey Little Magpie sale is still on as of the day I am filming, which is Friday the 7th. And I imagine it will be going for some time until I just get rid of it all. Um, some of the good stuff, you know, the good stuff is long gone, I'm going to admit, but it's worth having a little look. So head on over if you feel so inclined so yes i have no idea where i'm going to put all those papers and my thickers drawer is not drawer storage box is full so i don't know where i'm putting these either but yeah there we go so big congratulations and a huge thank you for watching this epic video and i'm gonna go i think i'd lie down actually yeah i'll do that i need to recover okay thank you for watching Bye -bye.